Jason Gesser wasn't your typical 6'4", strong-armed guy. Surfer type of dude from Hawaii, uh, loved to run around with his shirt off. All the girls loved him. Of course, he's the quarterback, so you know the quarterbacks get all the love. He just took so many hits and so many just over and over, and you know, these 280-pound guys landing on top of him, just killing him. Jason Gesser's not going out the field unless he can't walk. I mean, he'd get up every time and come back to the huddle, and I mean, same thing the next play. I remember he broke his leg, and I, I know he didn't want to come off the field. And Jason Gesser was turned away by a lot of big schools. Mike Price fell in love with him. Um, and Gesser was, if you just look at the hard numbers, was incredibly relevant and significant in the Pac-10. There's just not more than 10 quarterbacks in the history of the Pac-10 Conference that have those wins. One thing that I think really put Jason Gesser on the map is when it was our uh, 2001 year, our Sun Bowl year, I believe, uh, Jason Gesser, we were playing uh, Idaho, and he leaped over an Idaho defensive player. and. The next day at school, and people just, that's all they were talking about. Did you see Jason jump over that guy? Oh my goodness, you wouldn't believe it. And it got the whole team going. And I think that that's right when Bob Robertson said, uh, WSU, we've found a new leader.